Hello, I have a little Hobby Lobby haul here for you guys today. I went to a Hobby Lobby that is um, the one I usually don't go to because it's a little bit farther away. But I found this um, envelope notcher on Facebook Marketplace and the lady was selling that along with this uh, four inch brayer and this um, setter. It's like an instant setter. Um, so she was selling all three of those things for $5, which is a great deal because this uh, sells at Tuesday morning for $5 itself. So, and I could never find it. So I'm super excited about that. And it just makes a little notch in your envelopes or you can make gift card holders with it to hold the little, there's so many things you can make with it. So I've been wanting that because I do have the, um, the three in one board, um, but I could never find it. So yeah. And I also don't have this. I have a Crocodile 3, um, but I don't have this, and it's pretty cool. It comes in this little tin case. Um, and then it has a little a little mat and that. So, and I don't even know what this is worth or whatever, but I know that the envelope, not sure costs five dollars at Tuesday morning so I paid five and I got all this and then I got this brayer along with it which is really cool because I have one brayer but it's not um it's 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 a different kind so I mean I can always use that you know for five dollars for everything it's not like I spent any more on it so that was pretty cool so yeah so let me show you what I scored from Hobby Lobby. So they didn't have too much of a clearance. Um, they didn't have any dies on clearance. They only had wood stamps that I already had or that I didn't want. Um, they didn't have any paper pads or papers on clearance. So they had some other stuff though. So what should I start with? Okay, I'll start off with this, this jar. Sorry about the noise for $3. And we're just gonna use this for our sugar. And then I found all these little jewelry pieces. I found this one, and I don't have this one yet, the green. And it just comes with three little charms. Um, I got this. It's just a little silhouette image, and it was only 18 cents. I got this. It's like a locket ring for 75 cents. And then I got this, which is really cool. This was $1.20, and it flips. And I did order some leather cord and this was a dollar twenty um to make the to make some necklaces for my boys okay and then I got so I picked up this lace for a dollar and this ribbon pink sparkly ribbon and I got this purple lace for 50 cents and this and this is like that um that trim everybody was hauling the gold one but this one is lavender and this was a dollar. And then this one. And this was also a dollar. And they have, this has wire in it to shape it. So it was pretty cool. And the normal price on these was $4, $4, $1.99, $2.99, and $3.99. Because this is like the wide place. So that was pretty cool. Um... Then I picked up, I finally got the little eyelash stamp that I've been wanting. And it was $3.99 and it wasn't on sale. And I used my coupon on something else, so. But I picked it up anyway. And then I also got this one and this one was also $3.99, the macaroon. So I knew if I didn't get them, they wouldn't have them, so I just bought them. And then I picked up this paper pad for $8.99 and I did use my coupon on this because the paper wasn't on sale and I absolutely love it. I'm so into this little trailer thing right now. It's not even funny. So I'll just do a flip through here. I'm gonna do this like this. There we go. So it's like fire marshmallows and my son's in Boy Scouts so I can find so many uses. So there's four of each one. Okay, there's a yellow and some of them are plain but the little lemonade, pink lemonade and yellow lemonade like a tablecloth checker, um, the little forest, a colorful forest, I love that, love that, love that, love that, 
like a string of lights. Little trailers. I so love these trailers. And then clouds. Turtles. Forest with deer. Hedgehogs, I think. Pink and yellow. Flags or banners, pennants. And then here's the little cutouts. Let me see. Yeah. Yeah. And this paper is thick. It's not like really thin. I love the cutout. I just, I love them. Wow, you get four of each of the cutouts too. That's awesome. The bikes. Another page with the trailers bigger. Um, and then this one is sunglasses. And then the last one is like this floral image. So this ended up costing $5.39 after the 40% off. And that's pretty good. I mean, there's... 20 designs for each, 80 sheets. So I thought it was pretty good anyway. And then I got this. I saw somebody else haul this and I had to have it. I like it because the uh, rainbows, you can paper piece them. And you can also paper, pa or not paper piece. You can make them different colors. Paper piece is what you have to do when it's not in different pieces. And then you can change like the tail and stuff on the um, unicorn. I'm going to open it up real quick. This is what they did with it on the back. Absolutely love it. And it was regular price $14.99, and it was only 30% off, which sucks because you could get it for $40 if you use a coupon. But Hobby Lobby is not by my house, and it's closed on Sunday, and that's the day I do a lot of my shopping. So I just got it. So, yeah. And then it has an embossing folder, too, which is pretty cool. So, yeah, I thought that was cute. And that was, how much was this? It was regularly $14.99, and it was 30% off, which means it was $10.49. So that's not bad. You get the rainbow that you can piece together. You get the unicorn, and I love that unicorn. And an embossing folder, so not bad. 11 dies, one embossing folder. So I'll just put that back later. Then I picked up these, and these were regular price $49.99, and they were on clearance for $12, which is only 50 cents each. And these are the water color pencils. And I'm super excited about these. Because the only water color pencils I have are from the Dollar Tree. And I just bought them because I wanted to see if I even liked to watercolor first before I spent money on a set. So to find these for $12 was a super deal. So super excited about that. And then I got this just a little water brush. Um, and I got this, I used, I think my daughter bought this and used the coupon for this. Yeah, I'm pretty sure. Yeah. Was it? Yeah, I think it's on the other receipt. I'm pretty sure I did. Yeah, 30%, 40%, 40%. Yeah. Okay, anyway, that's taking too long. So anyway, it's regularly priced $8, and I'm pretty sure I didn't pay regular price for it. So anyway, there's that to use the water clip. Then I picked up this awesome journal, and it was on clearance for $3.75. Regular price was like $20 or something crazy like that. And it's this really, it's real leather, I mean, and it's this really kind of cool paper. I don't know if you can see it, but it's like for doing mixed media, I think, like art journaling. I love it. I mean, because you can use, you know really good ink in here or whatever so I was really excited about that for three I think it was 375 and I picked up these little stickers they were $1.99 and you get two sheets and then I found these things that were on these are the only paper things they had on clearance this was two dollars and twenty-five cents with the faith line and I'll just 
just open it up quick here. For the Carpe Diem. So you get this. Oops. And they're all double sided. And then let me see. This is inspired. It says inspired, and then it says reading, loving, learning, listening, hoping, changing, enjoying, and remembering. That's awesome. And then it has a one through five things you're grateful for, and then praying. I love it. And it's double sided, like I already said. And then, so you get those. Then here's another one, and it says, He restores my soul. Psalms 23, 3. And this one says, Be joyful in hope, patient in affliction, faithful in prayer. Romans 12, 12. Love it. Let all that you do be done in love. 1 Corinthians 16, verse 14. Love that. And I love the jar with the flowers. That's in the whole faith line. I love it. I have the paper pad. Give thanks to the Lord, for he is good. His love endures forever. Psalms 107, verse 1. And then this one says, For with God nothing is impossible. Luke 137. Love it. And then this one says, Let your light shine. And then it has some note paper. Nope. Yep, just note paper, and some of them have different designs. Then you got this, and I love this flower print, and this is on the back, and these are dividers. Then you got this, and it says, Be still and know that I am God. Psalms 46, 10. Love it. And then the, I love the feathers. Love, love, love. And then that's on the back. And then finally, this one. Trust in the Lord with all your heart and lean not unto thine own understanding. Proverbs 3, 5. 3, verse 5. I love it. I love that. And then you also get a little pocket. I love the wood on the flower. I love it. I'm so excited. So there was that. And that was $2.25 regularly, $8.99. So I'll put that away later. And then I got this, and this was only a buck. Inserts and stickers. Heidi Swap. And it was originally $3.99, so 75% off. And it says for use with the memory planner, which I don't have one. I keep wanting to buy one, but then I don't because I have enough planners. And it comes like tablet style, like, see? And it says make a plan, overview, date, time, location, action items, and then it has check marks where you can check when you're done. And then on the back, it has a checklist and top three goals. Awesome, awesome, awesome. And I mean, you don't have to use this in the memory planner. So that was pretty cool for a dollar. And then last but not least, I picked up the tag punch. And I, I opened it up so I could show you guys what it does. So this was normally $19.99 and it was on sale. It was 40% off, so it was $12, bucks, I know, because, yeah, it was $12, bucks, which is pretty good for Hobby Lobby prices. So this is the punch, and you put the tag in there, and it does one and a half, two and a half, and two. And I punched some out. So this is the two and a half. And it also, if you can see at the top, it like embosses right there where the hole goes. So cool. So it cuts evenly on both sides if you put it in real, very evenly. Um, and then this is the uh, one. No, this is the two inch. Yeah. Is it? Yeah, this is the two inch. Yeah. And then it's like, and it's a different style. Yeah, it is. It's a different style from this one. Well, it's the same thing, but it cuts the sides off, basically. So it looks like a different style. And then this is the 1.5, the little tiny one. And you can make them as long as you want. So, and this is what it looks like, and you put it in that way. So, and I have the, 
We are memory keepers one. And I think I paid ten dollars for this one. So and that was a Tuesday morning. So that's not bad to get it for twelve. And this one like um makes a thing at the top, like a where you double it over. Um and then this one has different sizes. This one has two inch, just like that one, but then it has one and a half, just like that one, and then a one. So so this one makes uh, a half an inch bigger one. And they're different styles. So I wanted to have both of them. Let me get a piece of paper and punch some of this in real quick here. Let me just grab um, some double sided paper here. Here. Quickly here. I'll just grab anything here. So let's do. And here's this one. Let's do this one. All right. So I'm just going to cut this paper. And this one does one, one and a half, and two. Okay. So I'm just going to use my little trimmer here really quick, really quick here so I can show you guys. I'll just do one. So okay, I'll do it this way. So I'll do the one inch one first. And on the other one you have to have it pretty accurate to get it in the little slot. Let's see, okay, that's pretty accurate, I'd say. No, it's not. Hey, we gotta go over one more. Okay. There we go. Is that beautiful? Yeah, I think that's almost. Hang on. I'm trying to rush here, so yeah. All right, I'm gonna do it this way. Gotta have it kind of even if you want it to look even. So that's a that's the one inch. That's one inch. Yeah, I guess it is. Yeah, that's one inch. Okay, that's pretty small for a tag, but that'd be cute, like for an embellishment. Okay, so you push it all the way back, and remember, you gotta cut it a little bit longer because you gotta flip it over. At the top okay so then it comes out like that and then you just flip it over that's a little itty bitty 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 tiny dig but I guess and then you could always use this on a, uh, as a topper on an you know on another tag or whatever um, and then you how do you do it so you do it like this and then I think you Fold it in like that. Yeah, like that. Does that look right? Yeah, I think that's how you do it. I don't know, something like that. So, and then you, of course, don't have it that long. I don't know if that looks right. That doesn't look like it did when I made it last time, but whatever. Let's cut it off a little bit. I want to make a bigger one. These little ones just don't don't look right to me. So yeah, that would be a little tight. I mean, I guess. It just doesn't look right to me. This side looks better. Okay, so that's probably the front. Cute. Okay, now I'm gonna do, I'm gonna just do the biggest one, the two inch. And so you put it in with the side you want to be on the front facing down would be it. Yeah, because, yeah. Okay. So you just put it in there. And you line it up inside the little guides and you push it all the way back. And remember, you gotta cut it longer so that you can fold it and then Yeah, 
Yeah, so it would be that. Okay, we want it this way. Oh, so it doesn't matter what side you put it. Duh. Yeah, it does. Yeah, it does. Because see, one's smaller and one's bigger, so I don't know. Yeah. So you bring that over, and then you bring that through. Like that. Is that right? I don't know. Yeah, that's right. Okay. This doesn't look like it did the first time I did it, so. There we go. And then it holds it. Okay. That's right. So it does matter what way you put it in because it's one side's smaller and one side's bigger. It does a top of it punches a bigger one and the one under it is smaller and then you fold it over so that looks about right I think so that's a two inch one yeah I'm pretty sure all right well thank you for watching my little tiny haul and oh something I wanted to say when you're when you go to Hobby Lobby watch what they're doing because my daughter got a bunch of Valentine's Day stuff that was supposed to be like deeply clearance, like it said 30 cents. And she charged me full price. So I paid $2.99 for Valentine's Day items that were supposed to be 30 cents. And I mean, she already opened them, so that's like $5.40. And then she also charged me $4.99 for like a Valentine's Day mailbox thing that I know wasn't supposed to be $4.99. So anyway, I usually do watch along with what they're doing. Um, so yeah, but thank you for watching my video until next time. Bye-bye.